planning your meals and knowing what you're going to eat 24 hours before you're going to eat it is going to be the biggest part of success for diabetes reversal, for fat loss, for anything that you want to accomplish. Now, let's think about why. We want to be proactive about what we eat. We want to eat on purpose. We don't want to eat on accident. So what is eating on purpose versus eating on accident? If I go to work and let's say there's donuts or bagels that are there, then I roll by and I'm like, hey, you know what, I'm just, I'm just gonna grab one. That's eating on accident. Eating on purpose is that, hey, let's say that I have eaten breakfast and I carry snacks with me. Um, we, I, what I usually have is something like uh, boiled eggs. Um, I snack on tomatoes, I'm kind of weird. Um, I eat tomatoes whole, um, snack on apples, cheeses, stuff like that. And I take that to work with me and I, I roll by where they have bagels and donuts. And I'm like, you know what, I don't need that because one, I'm not hungry because I just ate breakfast. Two, I have snacks in my office. And so that's eating proactively, that's eating on purpose. And the smallest amount of change in your entire day has huge consequences over a period of time. And one example that I always use is that let's say that for every day in your life you've eaten a candy bar that's 250 calories. Let's call it a Snickers bar, for example. And you stop eating that Snickers bar. By the end of one year, you will be down about 24 pounds of fat, uh, calories and fat. And so you think about it, if that's just one little Snickers bar every day for an entire year, Something so small can have a huge significant impact at the end of the year. Now, there's a lot more to it than, than that physiologically in the body, but that's just an example of what compounding effects are for a very small change. So if we eat one meal a day on purpose and plan for it, then that has a significant compound effect. Now, if we eat all meals for the day or multiple meals for the day, then you're going to have a lot of dramatic effect very quickly. So think about this as you watch the next video for day six. And Mimi will explain a little more about meal planning, meal prepping, and stuff like that. All right. Thanks a lot, guys.